Only seven are worthy of your light. I still don't understand that. Hmm. Uh, I know that I should talk to Takal on it. Though for a spirit of the Master Amochi seems quite busy. Wonder where she ran off to. Wonder if she's busy yelling at Knuckles, that might be the case. <laughs> huh. But hmm? Wait a minute. Is that another one of those? It looks like a throne. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, it is an ancient relic. But is this the same one? Huh. Not sure if it's just like the other ones. Huh. Hey! Huh? Uh. Hi, sorry, am I intruding? Uh... No, I don't... Hmm? Are you okay, miss? Hmm? Whoa, easy. I'm not here to fight. I didn't realize this area was off-limits. Uh... What? I will say this once. And I will say it again. I uh, will show violence if you come to this KSMO territory. Uh, miss... I'm sorry, but I was just exploring around here. I had no idea if this was occupied territory. Or sacred grounds. Wait a minute. Here. The fire is Never mind. Fire? What fire? Blue. Sorry, uh, no, no. I see... I see what's good or evil. Sorry about that. Uh, uh okay. Uh, I thought you were someone else. I apologize for my actions. Who, who did I look like to you? I don't remember. Recently, I'm in this trial, and I don't remember who I am. All I remember is a like, black cat with green eyes, but l with the ponytail at least. Oh. That's all I remember. <laughs> Hmm. Huh. Amnesia, I see. And you said you're on a trial, huh? Yeah. Hmm. Huh. And yet you don't remember. Did they even give you an explanation as to why or what the issue is? All I know is I have to, to stop. I have to stop this hedgehog named Lord X. Oh. Talk about throwing the Might sheep right over to the wolves. <laughs> huh? I've heard stories about that Lord X, but it all I guess it all depends upon I guess it all depends upon the dimension and whatnot, especially all the random Sonic.exes that have been popping into that have been popping up across the multiverse. That. Hmm? I guess the multiverse is real after all. Sorry, one of my sisters t keep telling me about stories and myths and legends about the multiverse. If warriors in there. <laughs> guess I was right. Yep, yeah, well, multiverse is real. Even there are moments where I have to travel through dimensions. Even sometimes, well, even there are sometimes when my teleportation decides it's gonna be in a funk, I accidentally end up in another dimension. <laughs> Yeah, my transmission has been a little bit goofy, but I went to this different dimension, and this Tails person, whatever his name is, gave me a new suit, so now I can do it with my speed now. Oh, nice. <laughs> well, looks like we still got the wise little fox, if we're talking about that Tails. <laughs> that was his name. Hmm. In the universe, it was called Cool Tails, I think. Hmm. Oh yeah, I've heard about the cool dimension. That was one of the dimensions that accidentally popped in. I met the Knuckles and Amy there once before. <laughs> he did say someone about a sailor piece. Are you her? Oh yeah, that's me. 
Huh. Guess the description of him talking about you did say it was a match then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and do you, I know you said that you have memory problems, but do you remember your name? I do. My name is Skylar Blue. Skylar like, Blue. Just call me Sky. Okay. <laughs> nice to meet you, Sky. Nice to meet you too, Sailor. <laughs> just call me Peace. Anyways. Okay, Peace. <laughs> Anyways, what brings you here? Well, I was just wondering about here, but apparently I've noticed these ancient relics that have been, that my friend Cookie has been researching upon. I know my I know my buddy Dragon, he had a uh, ran into ran into one relic before. And from the information he gathered, it was call, called a pillar of light. It turned out that there are many other there are many other versions of this that have been popping up, and even we found one over in a light, huh? Mm-hmm. Turned out there was also another one over in the middle familiar. of a desert. Yeah, we found found another one in the middle of a desert, in a temple. Though, however, I've been able to hear whispers saying, pretty much stating. Only seven are worthy of your light. So I've been trying to figure that out, and I was ex I'm still really confused by all that. And looks like I found that one, and pretty much I was able to detect the same presence and light from that uh, from that one over in the desert. Hmm. Interesting. You know, actually, since one of my sisters was the Chaos Emerald of Light, which is the yellow one. She did say something about different relics and ancient spells about the light. Mm. Like, I've been training about it. Hmm. Hmm. What did she tell me before I left? She did tell me one thing, though. When the solar moon, arri when the solar moon arrives, be prepared for the light of the fight. That's what she said to me. Hmm. But these relics do seem familiar, though. Yeah. That one up top does... In my world. Yep. And there's a throne right here, too, so... That is definitely something... Mm. A little... I recognize those symbols. Hmm? I recognize that symbol. Those are the isolated towers. That's where the guardians are. Well, my guardians, at least. Guardians. Hmm. Yep, Mobius, Anubis, and Molybius. Those are the ones who put me in the trial in the first place. So all those gar guardians are named after planets or vice versa, huh? You can say that, yeah. Mobius is the god of neutral, Anubis is the goddess of good, and finally Molybius, who gave me the trial, is with evil. Still don't understand why that guy has such a nudge to me. I do everything to be a Chaos Emerald Descendant. I break one rule by accident, which I got accused for, and then he sent me to a trial so I can be mortal. Honestly, yeah. If it's one rule and they're putting you on trial for it, I'm gonna be honest, that seems way, way too harsh. Exactly. I've done everything to be a Chaos Emerald Descendant. Even my sisters agreed with me. Dakota out of all of them. Hmm. I'm so worried yeah. about them. I will say this. I kind of know some history when it comes to higher up beings, whether they're gods or not, and those that are quote-unquote below them. Those that seem to be really pushy on punishing someone for a very light crime or something that's just considered minor... Usually, yeah, they seem to be the ones that tend to have something up their sleeve. Now, Moebius, being a god of evil, honestly, probably him, him being a god of evil should at least say something. But, however, all I can say is try to at least push through that trial, and if he mentions anything else going about I recommend you be ready because if he's trying to pull something else out of his ass then you know hey he's up for something and I also <laughs> will state I will state this too because 
obviously, I'm not sure if the Lord X you're looking for is someone that I've encountered recently. I state Wait, this to him too. Hold you on. You encountered him? Uh, yeah. He apparently found me while I was out uh, on my own for a little while, just trying to at least take a breather. Not even villains will let me take a breather every once in a while either, but... I will state this, though. I stated this over to him, because... Let's just say that another, uh, god had even told me this, too. Even gods have weaknesses. They may be all-powerful, they may be the higher up because of their ranking, they may have superior strength or magic or whatnot, but every god has a weakness and a downfall. You just gotta be smart about it. We do know one thing about Moebius. He is afraid to lose. Because when the whole drought's done, we can ask to challenge him. <laughs> but that will lead to an absolute beating, since I only know dark magic and ancient chaos spells. Other than that, Chaos Saber. That's what I use best. <laughs> well, as the guardian of Mobius here, at least this Mobius, I definitely do recommend that during your trial, try to also increase, try to at least increase your training a little bit as well. That way, at least you are fully prepared. But it's not just the strength or the magic that you need to work on. I also do recommend working on the mind. Even for someone like me who's having difficulty with uh, her mind recently, it's best to at least have your mind strengthened up. That way no one can get into your head, especially during battles, because usually you can tell somebody's being the most cheekiest, if not the most slyest in your battle. And, on top of it too, make sure that you also follow your heart as well. Your mind and your heart. Thanks. I really needed that. However, back with the relic thing and the amulet, also the legends, I can actually translate one of these. Okay. But it doesn't make any sense though. It says hmm. here, follow the light. But, oh, wow. it does say, follow the darkness. Which doesn't make any sense. Because if you follow the darkness, it doesn't make any sense, but... Hmm. Hmm. Could be talking about balance. Maybe that's it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, trust me. <laughs> Pretty much, you gotta fall... Pretty much, in order to achieve good balance, obviously, there's gotta be good and evil. But, however, when I first heard, heard that, I heard that from a, fr from a friend who had mentored me in balancing and controlling a uh, being that I once had take possession of me. She no, she's no longer around, but it also helped me out, though, in the future. When it comes to balance, not only is it best to have balance, obviously, everywhere, but also balance within yourself. So when it said, follow the light, follow the darkness, in a way, it could also mention as be the balance within. Follow the That's the end of the relic. Well, the spell that I just wrote, like, like right over there. So... Follow the light, follow the darkness, find the balance, and so then you fight the darkness. Oh no. I know what it means. <sighs> I gotta get a group of people, like a group of warriors. <sighs> Can I tell you something? Go on. Between Guardian to Descendant? Mm -hmm. Have you ever heard of the Chaos Emerald Descendants? I've heard of Chaos Emeralds. First time I've been hearing about descendants. Well, you're talking to one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm the most powerful spirit. Mm. 
and you've got light, power, nature, cosmos, all the other meanings. I don't remember what happened to me in the past, but what I do remember is that I saved a friend a long time ago, or a companion. I don't know what it is, but let's just say a companion. And all I saw was a cyan lightning bolt, and that's how I got chosen. But I see. I'm gonna be really honest. It's not fun to be a god. It's not. Hmm. Once this trial is complete, I'm gonna ask the descendants to find another spirit descendant. I'd rather live my own life being immortal. Like, well, mortal at least. Not immortal. Because that, I... I want to see what pain is like. Pain. Comfort. Emotion. I met this person named Max the Rockstar Hog, and... There was these joke people who were laughing, and I started laughing too. Normally, I don't have emotion, but some reason i i felt it mm -hmm. and i liked it well i will tell you this guy although you may have been chosen to be a descendant but in the end only you can decide which path that you be able to take which direction that you would like to go. If you believe that you would like to live the rest of your life as a mortal, that is completely up to you. Just make sure you take the precautions of, of mortals, but at the same time, make sure that whichever choice you go with, that you will not regret it in the future. Okay. try my best. Speaking of which, there's another storm coming. I mean, oh, that's my cue. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> you might want to see this. I actually really wanted to try out this suit. <laughs> well, All right. this might hurt, but nice to meet you, sailor. It's nice to meet you too, Sky. See ya! Huh. Chaos Emerald Descendants. Wait. Was it what these pillars are talking about? Huh. Don't know. But... Only seven are worthy of your light. Follow the heart. You will be alright. However, if you choose dark, then you will see the light. For this type of dark could try to damage you. Huh. Well, I got a little bit more info. How about I make sure to let Cookie know on this? Uh... Sorry. But I'm, I'm gonna say this once and say this twice. I will show violence. But I will show violence if you... Get in the... Uh, I, I screwed up. Fuck. Okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Here, here, here. Let me go ahead and put the sword away real quick. Okay, go ahead and see <laughs>